Guys, in this video, we are going to talk about the start settings on Windows 11. So in Windows 11, as like any Windows version there has been, the Windows icon itself is the start button. So click on that and this page is start. So I have the pinned icons right here and in the bottom space right here, you have your recently opened or downloaded files that you can see. I personally haven't put them on. But you can see recommended to show recent files and new apps you can turn them in the start settings open up settings i have it pinned right here you can also just search for settings right here so click on settings and you've come into the home page of the settings so you have all the settings right here you can also personalize your device from here but we'll go deeper into that in this video so on the sidebar you have home system bluetooth settings network and internet and personalization right here so click on personalization Again, you have background colors, themes, dynamic lighting, but what you are interested right now is the start. So you can see there's a start settings option right here. So click on that. So on top right away, you have an option for layout. So you have an option for more pins. So whatever apps you have pinned, you have an option to have them more. The default option is to have them 50 50. I have personally set it on more pins and you also have an option for more recommendations so anything right here can be a more uh, space taking part of the majority of the start uh, panel you can say will be recommendations but i like it more pins so i don't really like uh, recommendations you can see that so you also have an option here to show recently added apps so whatever apps you've downloaded or you've installed or you've side loaded it it will all show up in the bottom space right here. So if I turn it on, you can see the more you use the device, the more will show you new apps right here. So if I am to download any app, it will show right here. So you don't have to always go to all apps right here and then look for it or you don't have to search for it. So that is convenient if you like it. You also have an option to show most use apps. So say I am using Brave a lot. So it will start popping up over here all. So I don't really have to say uh, pin it on the taskbar or anything like that. I can just open start and I can just start the app from there. Then there's an option for show recently opened items in start, jump list and file explorer. So again, I don't like it. I like my start panel to be very clean. So I've turned it off. But if we turn it on. So whatever folders, files, apps I recently opened, they will also start popping up in this space. Obviously in this space because it is the start panel after all. And then you have show recommendations. So in the start panel, it will start showing recommendations for apps that you can download. So it will basically be like you're running an advertisement on your start panel, which is very annoying to me. So as you can see, I have turned it off. And you can also have account related notifications show occasionally in start. So say, for example, we are currently in my account. So if there's an issue with this, it will show a yellow dot and it will notify me that I am to update something or there's something wrong or, you know, there's some kind of change that is required. So it will always notify me with a yellow dot on here. So yeah, that was very easy. Those are the start settings on Windows 11. If you like the video, drop a like, share and subscribe.